Hey guys, Heather here and welcome back to my channel. As you can see in the title, we're gonna review Ixu Makeup Brand. I'm really excited for this video, so let's get started. So first off, disclaimer, all the video- all the videos in this item. <laughs> All the items in this video are bought by me with my own money so this is not a sponsored video Aww. although Iksu if you're watching this <laughs> the Iksu makeup brand is new here in Amman and is available only I believe in Mac stores I got mine specifically in Oasis Mall by the way it is a very, very, very affordable brand. That's why I got so curious and I wanted to review them. You know we want to save them coins as much as possible. <laughs> so let's hope we'll have another favorite makeup brand with a, f with a favorite price. <laughs> so let's hope, let's, let's, let's hope, let's hope. So... If I would go... Well, let's hope we'll have another favorite makeup brand with a great price. Let's review and test out what we got. I've already moisturized and applied the base, so let's start with Ixu Conceal and Correct the Perfect Cover Up. The price is only two reals. It has five color correctors. The yellow color can be used to cover up any blemish that's purple in tone, like bruises, veins, and under eye circles. The green color is correct redness, like pimples, sick or zits. The blue purple can be used to Neutralize yellow and orange hues, correct dark spots, and hyperpigmentation. Pale pink or peach cancels dark circles and brown spots on, on light to medium skin tone. Same with the orange uh, brownish one, but on deeper skin tone. For today, we'll use the yellow one for my under eye circles. I just got a brush. Let's test it out. I'm gonna show y'all. So I'm gonna add this yellow color corrector under. I'm gonna use this blush to blend it out. Okay, so it's very easy to blend. What do you guys think? Parang na alis naman niya yung dark circles ko. We're looking a bit yellow. Well, duh. <laughs> I think it's good. We're gonna use the next product to conceal it. But as of now, I love that it's cream and it's easy to blend. It definitely canceled out the dark circles under my eyes. So, so, so far, so good. Alright, so next up we have Ixu. Full coverage liquid concealer. So the price is only 1.5 Amani Reals. It claims to be waterproof and long lasting. I actually tried this one already. This was the first one I bought and I loved it. So I went back and purchased the rest of the products in this video. So she's a real influenza. <laughs> Alright, so when you open it up, 4ml by the way if that's important to you hello anyway so it just looks like that and let's apply I love I love the creamy texture I don't love the smell as much I love how full coverage it is but I don't love how it <laughs> how dry it can get I suggest blending it to the skin right away otherwise it will dry and it'll be harder to blend and patchiness will appear other than that I love it 1.5 reals <laughs> sign me up <laughs> next to review is Ixu conceal and contour it for a flawless finish. So again, it has five shades, which I love, and it's only two reals. Let's try it out. It also has a creamy texture, as you can see. Okay, so it's easy to blend as well. All right, so I actually tried the darker one. I think that's better. I don't know. I love how it's only two reals, and it has the five shades. You can definitely use this one for concealer and then I use the third one. I so I'm putting a creamy texture, not that hard to blend. Yeah, I can definitely see myself using this again. It's good. So, 3 out of 3 so far, Ixu. Next one is the Ixu Transparent Setting Press Powder Shine Control. So, that's that's a mouthful. This is only to Reels. A little ASMR moment. Okay. Oh. Oh, okay. What? What is this for? 
Oh, so it comes with a cushion. So I'm guessing this is the applicator for our pressed powder. Mm, mm, mm. I'm not gonna be using that because I didn't wash it yet. It's definitely white. So, so we're gonna get the 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 the, the brush. Hopefully there are no breakouts, you know what I mean? Hopefully this would be a successful review and we just we be saving points. Let's add a little more. The powder doesn't have any scent as well, which is great because as much as possible, I don't want any scent. So I can say that it feels very light on the skin, like it's I don't feel it's there, which is good because I don't want a caked up face. And I mean, it definitely doesn't give off that airbrush finish, but it can go in my daily makeup routine. You know what I mean? So, it's alright. Unfortunately, they didn't have any blush in the stall, I, which I'm kind of upset about. It's one of my favorite makeup products. So, anyway, we'll just use another brand for this step and... I'll be right back. Alright, we're back and we're ready for the next one. It's time for the eyes. I'm very excited for this. We have the Ixu All About Eye Eyeshadow Palette. It is three money reals. This one is named the Glam Edit. The palette has 12 color eyeshadows mixed with matte and shimmer. So far, it's picking up a lot of pigment. Let's use this taupey Taupe. color for our base. That's darker than I'd hope. <laughs> I'm color blind. <laughs> and it definitely has shimmer on it. Could have added concealer or eyeshadow primer. I just feel like it won't last long. Colors would fade maybe two years. Two years <laughs> in two months. Two minutes. Two hours. I meant. I feel like they're all shimmers. I don't know. You be the judge. Hold on. Can you see all the fallouts? A lot of fallouts. Let's just clean that up a little bit. And we are back. I did a little bit more than just cleaning it up a little bit. I finished the whole eye. It was such... It was such, let's just say I had such a hard time cleaning the fallouts and they are pigmented. It was so hard to get off my skin, the fallouts. I would recommend using this before finishing the base. I love it. I, lo I love the colors. I love that it's all shimmer. Hence the name of it, the Glam Edit. Makes sense, right? I think if I didn't do my base, it would have been a hundred times easier. It's not as easy to blend. I really had a hard time blending. I think you can still see some of the patchiness, but I really tried to make it work. The colors that I didn't use, let's just swatch it on my hand. Ooh, wow. I love it. I love the shimmers. Just the fallouts, really. Alright, so that is the eyeshadow look done. Let's go to the next makeup product. Hey guys, Heather here. You still don't know what gift to give? I have a suggestion. Aventino Watch. So excited to announce I am the newest exclusive representative for Aventino Watches. <laughs> Go to AventinaWatches.com, choose any watch of your choice, then type in and enter the discount code HEATHER15, H-E-A-T-H-E-R 15, then click apply. Using my code HEATHER15 gives you 15% off your total purchase. Perfect for the holidays, birthday, anniversary, or you just want to show an appreciation for a special someone. Or give yourself a gift. You deserve it. I mean, it's the end of 2020 and we're still here. That deserves a gift. <laughs> it's such a great deal for a great product. So, happy shopping! Oh 
next we have Ixu Intense Eyeliner Pen. This is only 1.5 Omani Reals. Let's open it up. Oh, I kind of want to do this off camera in the shade Black Drama. I'll swatch it for you to see the texture and the feel of the products. We're, we'll do this off cam. Hold on. I'm a be big. Okay, we're back. Did the cut eye on both eyes. I had high hopes for this because when we swatched it earlier, it's so dark. But now it just picks up the eyeshadow on my lid. Because of that, it was so hard. Can you see this little fade out moment here? Basically, when I applied it on, on this eye, it was perfect. But it started to pick up a little bit of the eyeshadow. Went to the left eye. Seems like I've been using this for 30 days, you know what I mean? I had to just layer it and layer it and layer it. But see? And we just open it up. You saw it. We just opened it up. I'm kind of upset about this because I love a good cat eye and I always use it as my go-to look. But so we didn't come through with this one. Anyway, let's move to the next one. Next, we have the Ixu Retractable Eyeliners. This is only one Omami Real. I'll show you how much of the... <gasps> It, it, it's white. Oh no. Oh my gosh, I'm so stupid. Oh man, I told the lady. I want it black. Definitely did not expect it to be white. But okay, anyway. Uh, this is... I just cannot believe it got white. I didn't even check. I didn't even check. There's a bee in right here. But okay, this is how much of the product they give you. Oh. Oh wow. Oh wow. Can you see the chalky consistency? It just got stuck here and it Aww. wouldn't blend over here. Hmm. That's ugly. <laughs> Alright, so let's just stop right there. So it ain't why no more. It's it's the color of my eyeshadow, just like oh this one is not as I wouldn't recommend her, so and my lower lashes are now white. There's just blocks of white stuck in there so hopefully when we go to the mascara we're gonna fix this so let's go to the next one all right next is the mascara this is the extra volume mascara with argan oil slash waterproof i love the packaging let's open her up she's pretty i love applicators like this this is only two omani reals i already curled my lashes I most definitely love the brush. I mentioned earlier, I lean towards brushes like this. Application-wise, it was perfect because it was kind of like combing my, my lashes. It was kind of hard getting it on the bo bottom lash. It's kind of hard to get on there without smudging and without touching the skin. So be careful with that. Other than that, this mascara, I'm loving this mascara. I'll just quickly add on lashes off camera. We didn't have an Ixu brand lash one, so I'll be back. Alright you guys, so the lashes are on. We are finished with our eye makeup look. So now, it's time for Ixu lip products. So I got two lipsticks, an ultra matte lipstick and a moisture one. And also we got two liquid lipsticks and one lip gloss. Let's start with the moisture one. This is the moisture matte lipstick by Ixu. This is 1.5 Amano Reals. So this is in the shade Baby Doll. So let's open her up. I love that you can see the color right there. And let's twist. <gasps> twist. <gasps> oh no! Mm, so clearly. Oh. This is my first time opening her up. So let's just try to transfer this. Okay. <laughs> that was literally the first time I opened it. Okay. Okay. It's good. You saw this is how much product you get for one 1.5 Montreals. Let's try this on my lips right now. Mmm. Smells so good though. Smells like candy. They didn't get the name wrong. It says baby doll, right? So I kind of feel like a baby doll right here. 
Is it the same? So that's good. We get accuracy from the texture outside. The color shade, I don't know. I should have chosen one that doesn't look as flat as this one. But moisture, it, it sticks by its name. We'll give her that. We'll give the points. So let's try the next one. Okay, next we have the Ultra Matte Lipstick. It's a lot lighter than the other one, which was already light. So I'm kind of nervous about this. This is in the shade Sugar Holic. So, oh, the packaging's not broken on this one. We get this much product. Not gonna lie, my lips already feel dry. It kind of smells like Nivea. The lotion? Yeah, exactly like Nivea. Or Nivea. <laughs> oh, Sugar Holic coming in the room. It just looks like my lip color better i mean just more vibrant this is also 1.5 which is a good deal i love the color it's not as flat as the other one well on my skin tone i'm gonna wipe this off and let's go to the liquid lipsticks now let's try their liquid Ooh, almost dropped it I'll start with the candy crush this is two omani reals what we get I love the packaging as well honestly the top of my lip is kind of itching right now i don't know if it's Oh, that smells good. It smells like a perfume. Okay, we'll try it out. Candy Crush definitely has a lot of pigment. It has a scent, so if you don't want any scent, it has a scent. A very strong woman perfume scent. It's kind of like a hint of glue. I don't know. <laughs> it's just me in my nose, you know. But what I love about this is the color finished product right on here. It's not dry. As you know, liquid lipsticks tend to get dry, but this one, so far, not so. It's just a bit itchy on my top lip right here. Alright, so now let's try the other shade. That's as good as we're gonna take it off. So now we're gonna try Dusty Pink. Same packaging, same everything, just to shade. It's a little bit on the feature side. I love this. Dusty Pink? Yeah, we love this one. Kind of has like that um, peach or orange undertone. It doesn't show off that you know, much on the camera. Yeah, def definitely leaning towards pink. Okay, so we love this. We love for we love the dusty pink. Last but not the least, we have the Ixu moisturizing lip gloss. So I I think I'm just gonna swatch it on here and show it on. The lip that we had, which is the dusty pink. Alright, so we open her up. And this lip gloss is 1.5 Amani Rios. Okay? And this is in the shade Strawberry Fizz. Should I remove my lipstick? Because normally how I would wear this is on top of a lipstick or on top of a liquid lipstick. But I guess for the sake of this video, let's just remove the dusty pink and just try this out on its own. Okay, I'll be back. Okay, so I did my best with removing the liquid lipstick. Still have a little staining left, but it's fine. It's fine. It's normal for liquid lipsticks. Mm, I don't like the smell. It's definitely glossy. I love the color of the strawberry frizz. Just, I don't like the scent. It's kind of like um, plasticky in a way. Let's try this on top of maybe dusty pink. Alright you guys, so this is a finished makeup look using Ixu makeup products. I hope this review has been helpful and useful. Comment down below what Ixu products you're interested to try. My top 3 Ixu products would definitely be Conceal and Contour. Uh, mascara and the liquid lipstick and my least favorite products would definitely be the eyeliner but maybe if I get the shade black it would be better but as of now nope and the eyeliner unfortunately it just fades out and just dries out real quick and the pressed powder just because it didn't really give me that airbrush finish it's okay it's okay. Okay guys, don't forget to subscribe and like the video. I really appreciate that. And follow me on my Instagram. I'm trying to hit 6k. It's at Heather Heather underscore underscore underscore. The link will be down below. We can do it guys. And also here, we're trying to reach 60... 68 subscribers. 
for 70 subscribers. I mean, come on, just subscribe and just hit like. Thank you so much. Shukran. Maraming salamat po. Stay safe, stay fab, and I'll see you in my next video.